What is up guys, Proscots here with a new Minecraft Pocketion update video. And I'm going to be going through some of the confirmed features and some of the possible features in 0.7.4, 0.8.0 and 0.9.0. First things first, from the Minecraft forum post, uh, the official updates thread. For 0.7.4, the confirmed change in bug fixes are the lighting for the chests, flat chest in hand, Shaking chest when you break them. Back key and chest GY issue. I've not had that yet, but armor and health icons obstructing the side menu. Again, I've not had that, but I can imagine what it's like. Um, the splash text. I don't know if anyone's realised, but it doesn't change if you just go into the play menu, then go back. They need to fix that, so that's what they'll be doing. When you fly up high in creative, or if you have flying survival. You see the moon beneath you, they're going to fix that. The creative inventory, again anyone who hasn't seen this, when you die you get, an, you get a blank inventory and you have to scroll down the size of a creative inventory to get to the proper box. Half slab recipe, I'm not sure about this, I think, I think it's because it only gives you one half slab instead of three. I'm not sure though. And the crafting GUI doesn't recognise damage tools. Now I think this is, for example, I had a di um, say for example I had a diamond sword, and um, so I went into my crafting table with my diamond sword, but I didn't say I had a diamond sword because it was damaged. I it already had a few hits on it and it had the damage bar. Next up for 0.8.0, the confirmed features are minecarts, rails, and mineable redstone. So this is awesome because it means we get minecarts and rails. Which you know is going to be awesome. It's a new form of transport for us all. Uh, I think the recipe will be the same as PC. However, I'm not sure because there's less gold in the population world. Mineable redstone. That's like well, we'll get mineable redstone. But um, I don't know if you can place it. It's just for storage. Also, fire the night TNT. So say if I set a tree on fire, there's some TNT on top. The TNT wouldn't set off because the tree was on fire. Also, water flowing downward on farmland. I'm not sure what that is, but they fixed it. Next, from the Reddit post, um, somebody asked me if we can finally mine it, so we can at least start it somewhere, and Johan said yes. Also, can we expect caves in 0.8.0 and 0.9.0? They're hoping to add them in 0.9.0, which is going to be awesome. Another thing, we've got Wi-Fi Creeper, saying a dungeon might have temples, and village is 0.9.0. He's not sure about that yet. It's, it's possible, but I doubt it will be in yet. And there might be a replacement of a never reactor. And he think he says he think he, he might make it more awesome, like some sort of super dungeon. And he also asked about the Nether. This guy asked a lot of questions. And he said, Will the Nether be micro pocket And Johan said, It depends because mobile devices can't manage that well. So not for a while at least. And then there's also going to be a new terrain generator, but not yet. So, this will allow them, like a terrain.png generator, so it'll make them be able to add more blocks again. And new biomes and other stuff, which I assume is like more blocks. I'm not sure what blocks, maybe like pumpkins and stuff. But they're going to be adding that in 0.9.0. So will it be like the current PC one? I think that means of each individual texture. And if so, can we animate block textures? And obviously, he said that they had to restrict texture size. But they might release texture pack scripts, and they allow them to add a lot more blocks. Will redstone be implemented? No. Not in 9.0. Not in 0.9.0 either. Just mining redstone. It's a shame, but they can't do everything at the same time. <coughs> Infinite Worlds coming 0.8.0 they currently plan for 0.9.0 so that means massive bigger worlds I'm not sure what happen when you update your minecraft client I'm not sure whether the world will grow bigger or whether you'll just have like drops left aside I'm not sure but, um, he won't simply make the world infinite but it will make it like the PC I think you know like where there is an end of the world but it's just so big it feels like it's infinite Next, uh, this guy asked about smart hardware enemies breeding caves and better lighting. Transparent ice and smaller chat, and also the expiry of play controls. So he said yes to the first four. So, 
That's cool, they're going to add it sometime, but I'm not sure when. And he's not sure about the Xperia play. It's just... It's work in progress, let's just say that. This guy said it would be nice if we have Flint and Steel and create one version not by 7.4. And Johan said he was considering it, which means finally Night and TNT and Creative. And then this guy asked about the camera, which everyone always forgets. And as you can see, Johan did say he forgot. But they'll be starting your camera, you know, pictures, photos, whatever you want to call it, on your device. It'll be stored there. No pains, but I guess you could make it custom. And so as you see here, Rails are not 8.0, Redstone after not 9.0. And then someone asked about how Rails would work, and he said he'd always be powered, which is awesome. Presumably not when Redstone properly comes out, but for the moment they will be. That's in this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoy all these new features, talking about stuff. That made total sense. Anyway, that's all for now, guys. I will see you next time.